Hi, I'm the Toy Mom, and today we're going to see what's in this Monsters University surprise bag. We have 10 of our favorite students from Monsters University. Wow, they are a little different looking students than what I normally see on campus, but let's get them out and play. I hope I didn't scare you, but these characters in front of me from Monsters University would love to be able to scare you. They are from the Disney Store Deluxe Figurine Playset, and there are 10 characters from the movie Monster University. So let's meet each one of them individually, shall we? This is Archie the Scare Pig. And he is a mascot. Look at him, he has I think six, yeah, six legs. And right now, he's wearing the uh, MU initials, but that's only because MU stole him from Fear University. So that is Archie, the mascot. Sometimes universities do that. They'll steal the mascot of the other rival university. Here we have Terry and Terry Perry from Uzma Kappa Fraternity. That's one of the six fraternities on campus and a big rival with the other main fraternity, Roar Omega Roar. Now, these guys are hysterical because one of the Terrys, this one, likes to dance and that sort of thing and this Terry hates that sort of thing so he's kind of trapped when this Terry starts dancing and look at all those legs Woo. Could dance a lot with those legs huh so they're pretty funny then we have Art who's one of the strangest looking creatures I've ever seen and in the movie he moves around really funny he can twist his body all around to move and he is in the Uzma Kappa fraternity with Terry and Terry. Here we have Randall Boggs and Randall is in the other fraternity Roar Omega Roar and look at that smile he's got a lot of teeth in that mouth yes he does and that's not the most popular fraternity on campus. So sometimes Randall's not one of the most popular characters. So next, let's look at Carrie Williams. She is our only female monster today. And she has three eyes, pink skin, and red hair. How many kids are like that in the school that you went to? I didn't have any like that. And she belongs to the sorority Python New Kappa, or Pink for short, P and K. Next we have Don Carlton. Don is interesting because he's a returning student. He was a salesman and then he um, decided he wasn't doing as well as he wanted to in his career, so he thought he better return to college. So Don is a returning student, so as, as a returning student, he's, he's a little older than the other students. I like his glasses. Those are pretty nice. Here we have Scott Squishy Squibbles. And he has five eyes. I bet he can see the blackboard, huh? And look what he's wearing, the OK, which means that is the Uzma Kappa fraternity. And here he is in the back. And his mother's also in the movie, and she's pretty darn funny. All right, there you go, Scott, or Squishy. I guess we should call you that. And next, OK, we have 
Jonathan Worthington III. And Jonathan, he's pretty evil looking to me. He is the head of the fraternity of Roar, Omega Roar. And he's kind of a tough guy. I think as monsters go, if I met him on a dark street, I'd be pretty scared. Mm. And then we have this really big guy here. Look at him as a character next to all the others. He's the largest character in this set. And of course, he is James P. Sullivan, a.k.a. or also known as Sully. And he comes from a family of scarers, so he thinks he shouldn't have to study. But he learns a thing or two there at school. Look at his backpack. Carrying a backpack that makes him even more of a large character. And of course, who is his really good friend? You can see he is in the Uzma Kappa fraternity. He's going to look at you guys really closely. He's cute. You almost couldn't see him, or can't see him now. And that is our little Mike Wazowski. And of course, Mike is one of the smallest monsters, but he is probably the monster with the biggest heart as far as wanting to do well at the university. He really, really, really wants to become a scarer in his occupation. So look, he studied a lot. He knows that he's not gonna just be a monster unless he studies. So he studies a lot and he and Sully have some rough times in the movie but they actually become very 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 good friends and look they look pretty opposite but sometimes opposites attract. Well I hope you enjoyed watching and I'd love for you to choose another Monsters University surprise bag or one of my other surprise bags. And please don't forget to subscribe.